Now, South African scientists have launched a new project aimed at curbing rhino poaching. They've injected radioactive material into rhino horns to make them easier to detect at border posts. Even better, the radioactive material also renders the horns useless and poisonous if ingested. Rhino horns are highly sought after on black markets, where the price by weight rivals that of gold and cocaine. And South Africa is home to the majority of the world's rhinos. It is a hot spot for poaching. Despite numerous interventions, last year 499 rhino were killed, mostly in parks. The, um, the dosage is at a fairly low level, low enough that it will, will not uh, impact on the animal itself in any negative way, but yet it is strong enough that it can, be, can do two things. One is to render the horn uh, totally useless, not consumable by, by human beings. It's, it's essentially uh, poisonous for human consumption, for whatever uh, needs uh, people uh, use this for. But, but also importantly, uh, through the detection systems that we have at airports, uh, any rhino that is being uh, transported through our, through our airports will be detected because of the radioactivity.